The fuck going on with y'all, man? Welcome back to another episode of The Walking Dead. Last episode, I don't think too much happened, right? I can only remember two main things. One was, I think mostly the episode was about Eugene, on which side he truly is on. You know, part of me does want to believe he's doing it, or at least a part of him uh, wants to do it for Rick. And in the end game, he'll he'll pull through for us. But the way it's looking, he actually feels like you know he's saving people. He's an asset to the saviors, because he kind of is. I mean, he's doing way more for the saviors than he ever did for us, and that's just the truth. He's making inventions. He's he's uh, he's fixing their things. Um, you know, he he did do that stuff for us sometimes, but not definitely not to this extent. He is actually making quite a big of a difference. And over there at the Savior compound. So I guess I don't blame him, but you know, I just pegged everyone in Rick's core, and he still is a part of Rick's core, to be some loyal ass people, you know? Um, so because of that, I still a little bit believe that Eugene is somewhere still in there, not fucking Negan Eugene, you know what I'm saying? But it is what it is, I guess. Um, <clears throat> Um, so we got that going on there, the whole Eugene situation. I think he officially is a savior now, according to him. Especially now that we've, um, Daryl and Tara fucking ran a goddamn hole into the savior compound, which definitely messed with their plans, but it also messed with Rick's plan. And I feel like every time they mess with Rick's plan, initially, things go bad. And things did go bad, because Rick went to the garbage people to strike up another deal. He fought them. And they, <clears throat> uh, questionable, you know, uh, that Jada's had a gun the whole time, but she only brought it out when Rick was near her. So questionable fights, right? But that's TV. That's TV in a nutshell. That's movies, you know, they, they have to increase the drama. <laughs> we all get that, okay? So with that being aside, uh, Rick is going to the garbage people to strike up another deal, which it seems they have accepted. Unfortunately, part of that deal was uh, the, the Saver compound being surrounded by walkers, and currently it is not, because the walkers have broken inside because of Daryl. So again, it, ha it has happened. Daryl has kind of fucked Rick's plans all over again, and dare I say someone's going to die because of it. So anyway, that's where we are. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into it. This is Jill Walking Dead, Season 8, Episode 8. Eight. Uh, before I do, though, I am a few episodes ahead, and if you guys want to catch those early accessed episodes, you can go ahead and click that join button down below, and of course, become a member of the channel, okay? And if you want full versions of these reactions, you can go ahead and click that Patreon link down below and become a patron. Either or works, whatever you want to do. You can also click the Discord link down below as well, where you can click it, and join it, and say what's up to the community, all right? Uh, with that being said, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and hit the bell for the algorithms. And let's go ahead and watch the episode, y'all. Different from picture. Dang it! Coming from the window! We did it! Oh. <laughs> yeah, don't blame him. If I was on Jadis's fucking side of things, it looks like Rick just fucked him, so I don't blame him. Well, Maybe we'll see the garbage people once again. Maybe we won't. I don't know. <laughs> they definitely, um, you know, can give each each side an, an advantage though by their numbers and by their guns. So I mean, yeah, they kind they they, they matter. They kind of matter. Be out there picking strawberries with you again. That's what it takes. It's more than just hope. What are we just gonna kill all of them? Finding some way forward, that's harder. That's something more. There we go. Wise man Carl strikes again. He's right, though. And we, we, we've been saying it. Can't we just... We can't just kill everyone. This isn't that kind of show, right? We're supposed to kill the walkers. Not each other. That's what Carl's saying, yeah? And he's right, fuck. It's too easy to kill everyone. Drop it now. Get up slow. Grandma, Grandma. <laughs> 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 
Oh, fuck. No. <gasps> they killed the Jima. Oh, no. That's bad. So they're going to Oceanside to negotiate. But they killed Jima. No. That is the worst way to start off a negotiation with Oceans. I wish them the best of luck. Blues, it's over. So you're going to line up in front of your little houses and you're going to work up some apologies. And then the person with the latest one is going to get killed. Then I kill Rick in front of everybody and we move on. You have three. Count them three minutes to open this gate or we start falling the shit out. Shit. They're fucking here. Did he just say bomb the shit out of them? Did Eugene make some fucking bombs? Of course he did. He, he can and he will. God damn it, dude. He's a fucking savior now. Okay, well. I'm gonna need your help. Look, we got guns. We can fight them. We will. But not now. Carl's right. Carl, we can't just let them have this place. We can. All we need to do is survive tonight. This is my show. You said it. This is my plan. And you're gonna do it. You're all gonna do it. So let's go. Okay. Leader Carl. He is not unknown to do this. You know, he's well beyond his years. Fuck it. Follow his lead. He probably knows what he's doing. Seems confident. Seems sure of himself. <clears throat> Everything has changed. And yet nothing has changed. Everyone needs to hand over their guns. Gary. Shoot that beautiful bastard if anyone tries anything. Yeah. Same goes for everyone in the cars. I really don't want Jerry to die. I know he's just like a side side character, but I really fucking like him. He's got the best smile in the show. <laughs> yeah. You can stop this. Oh, now you want to talk? So your dad had it that I died no matter what. You gave my people a choice. Not me. So now we're going to need a new understanding. Apology. Honey, kill me. Oi. What? This is the plan? Bro, what? No, 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 no. Why? Why? What is this, Carl? Nice. No, he, he's, he's one of the ones that has to live and, like, live on. He's gonna be a fucking beast when he grows up. He already is a beast, huh? having a moment you little asshole <laughs> I guess it's oh, I hope this is part of Carl's plan I don't know what the fuck's going on Dude, is he fuck? Is he okay? What the fuck, dude? What is the plan here? Everyone escapes but him. Where is everyone else? How is how did Michonne? Uh, why did Michonne say yes to this plan? Oh, fuck. We need Carl alive, dog. Kill you in front of the whole place, and then drag you back to sanctuary and put you on a spike in front of HQ. Jesus. And then my people will lead the Walker herd to the hilltop and pull off the same move that your people tried unsuccessfully at our place. Damn. Simon is definitely the most menacing of all the leaders, including Negan. He, he just wants to shit to burn. <laughs> he doesn't give a fuck. Which I kind of like how there's like a kind of purely evil dude in the group, you know. Negan actually has some kind of morale. Just you know, a little bit. But Simon, no, nope, he's just, he's just a bad dude. Hi, Gary. I got this. I just really needed you to know what I was talking about. Who I was need that? You to smell it. Who was that guy in the back? Do we know him? I'm sorry. 
Fuck, bro. Fuck, bro. Jeez, 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 jeez. Simon. Is he okay? What the fuck is up now? It looked like he was just trying to take a shit. What was that? He looked constipated. Hmm. Eugene, Eugene. He just murked his own people. And she's pissed. I guess Dwight's on our side. That's, that was the... It was still questionable a little bit, but he just killed his own fucking people, dog. That's it. Okay, Dwight. I shouldn't be doing that. Okay. Drop the keys to a vehicle located just outside the aforementioned north side gate. <laughs> what the fuck? You're doing the right thing. What? Okay. Eugene is now helping both sides. See, I now I'm just confused. I thought he was full savior last episode, but he literally is helping Gabe take, take Dr. Carson out of this bitch to the hilltop. Take care of the baby. Or for Maggie's pre Maggie's pregnancy, which is a big fucking deal, because now I feel safe on that end of things. You know what I'm saying? Okay, Eugene, let's see it. Save him. <clears throat> Save me. Wait, Ezekiel, no. Oh, he's sacrificing himself. That's a kingly play. Damn. Well, now they got the, they got what they wanted, so now they're gonna leave the the kingdom alone for now, at least. That's that's a fucking kingly play right there. Okay, Zeke. Ugh, damn. Maggie, you don't want to do this. Shut up, Al. If Cupcake wants to put on a show. Let her put on a show. Oh. You want to be next? Fuck. No, I don't. Just like that? Oh man, man, I ain't playing now. Yo, I'm pissed her off. <laughs> <sighs> Fuck. This episode, man, there's a lot of drama going on in this fucking episode. Less action, but more like, you know, memorable moments type shit. Like, fuck. Your people are gonna look up at the sanctuary fence, and they're gonna see their king is dead. Morgan, save Ezekiel. Morgan, fucking save him. He know he can. He could take down ten guys on his own. And now he's fucking. He's clear now. He's clear, Morgan. Not Aikido, so he he's not gonna pull. He's not gonna hold back. He definitely can save Ezekiel right now if he wants to. I'm sorry. I am. Looks like the Alexandria is compromised for now. It's full of walkers, it's fucking bombs away, fire. So for now, we gotta sacrifice it for now. That's the play, right? We go in the sewers, we lay low or some shit. Then we come back later when everything's all good. That's what seems like the plan. Ooh. Ooh. Jesus, that face he had. Don't do that horror. Oh. 
Well, Rick, honestly, his, his record in 1v1s is not so great, and Negan is definitely a better fighter than some of the, fi some of the fights he had in the past, so, I mean... <laughs> They're all dead, and you missed them, all of you. This is your fault. <clears throat> Jesus. Why did he... Okay, why was his first thing to give Michonne a hug? Does he not have a knife or a gun? <laughs> anyway. Is he good? Why he look like shit? That's all. Huh? Oh. No, dude. Oh my fuck. My actual fucking soul just broke a little bit there. I felt that. What? Why? Whose idea was this? I don't like it. I guess someone had to die in the mid-season finale. But why I gotta be the most badass? The most mature? Really? That's what they're doing? I did not expect it to go that way. Please tell me there's like some, they, they find some kind of cure or some shit. I don't ask for plot armor much, but right now I'm kind of asking for it. What? Carl? They're killing off Carl. Really? That is really hard for me to believe. That is really hard for me to believe. Am I the only one here? Like, this is like kind of left field type shit. Um, why Carl? <sighs> so it happened when he was with Sadiq, right? When he was fighting in the forest against those walkers, one of the walkers got behind him when he was on the floor. A fight that he should have won easily, by the way, when he had a gun on his side. Ugh, oh, yuck. I'm a little disgusted. <laughs> You're telling me Carl's about to die? Really? Fuck, dude. He's supposed to be the one that lives. You know? Oh, no. I'm a little shaken up right now, bro. Of all the core, Carl was honestly one of the last ones I was expecting. Because I didn't, I, I just thought they wouldn't dare. They wouldn't dare kill a fucking badass 15 year old, however though, however old he is. You know, walker bodies, people bodies. Very fucking, you know, um, well beyond his years, mature kid. Tough, right? And they're killing him off? All that potential? Sheesh. Damn, they really aren't afraid to kill people. <laughs> Carl was one of those, man. He's supposed to live on. Holy shit. Um, but th at the same time, I thought the same thing about Glenn. I felt Glenn was going to be the ones to live on throughout the whole thing because he's just one of those go-to guys, right? And now they're killing off Carl. That hurts. I actually felt that when I saw the bite. It actually kind of like, you know, hurt a little bit here. Damn, bro. I, it is what it is, I guess. Fuck. Meanwhile, a bunch of other dramas happen, but I'm, everything is being overshadowed by now by Carl's death. I guess he hasn't died yet, but he's gonna die. He got bit by a walker. It's a very light bite. It's like literally one one chomp, but that's all it takes. Oof. Oof, 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 oof. Okay. Well. Um... I, I'm pretty sad. I'm pretty sad. It's definitely going to hit later. It's hitting right now. It's going to hit a little bit more later. Oh, I'm, this, is, this is like one of those debts I'm going to think about when I go to sleep at night, bro. <laughs> Carl, dude. Really? Again, he hasn't died yet, but he's going to die, right? Like, unless they fucking plot armor, find some kind of cure, or chop off his left. I don't know. He, he's, he's bit in a, in a spot that you can't chop off, so... And it's already been too long anyway. That's why he's been acting kind of, like, somber and different, right? He's been he's been definitely down in the dumps a little uh, recently. So what was, what was that he was writing earlier? He wrote Dad? He wrote Just Survive Somehow? Is that, like, a, good, a goodbye letter or some shit? Is that what he was doing? 
I'm sad. I'm sad. Anyway, that's going to be it for the reaction, y'all. I'm just going to keep talking about Carl and shit. It's going to make me even more sad. So anyway, y'all have a good one. Uh, I am a few episodes ahead. And if you guys want to catch those early access to episodes, you can go ahead and click that join button down below. And of course, become a member of the channel. Okay. And if you want full versions of these reactions, you can go ahead and click that Patreon link down below and become a patron. Either or works, whatever you want to do. And of course, last but not least, if you want access to my Discord server, you can come join and say what's up. All right. With that being said, I'm out of here. Y'all have a good one. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and hit the bell for the algorithms. And I will see y'all in the next episode of The Walking Dead. All right. Peace.